What? You see that? Wait a second. Okay, wait a second. Let me make sure I shake all this off good enough. Because look what we got at the bottom here. All right, what's up, Locker Nuts? It's locker time. Got this one right here for 710 bucks. I rented it for a month because I actually bought it a couple weeks ago. So I think we're about 820 bucks into this one. I think it's good. I think it's good. You ready? All right. First peaks. Yes. Oh, yes. You see what I like right away, right? Black and yellows. Uh-huh. I would have liked this rack right here, but that last locker had so many of those. I'm a little racked out. Okay, yes, iPhone just does better with low light, and of course it's got a light on it. Oh man, that's so much better. So check it out, guys. 5x10, I believe, and yeah. I mean, this actually looks better right here than that. That looks kind of messy, kind of, I don't know, miscellaneous, thrown about. Oh, okay, what do we got here? All right, I see a little Victoria's Secret tag there, or a strap or something. Maybe a box, see that? That's kind of interesting. I don't know, maybe. Hangers. There's a cooler. Not too much furniture. We got a little bit of furniture, like this uh, lamp right here. Ooh, what's this? Yeah, that, oh, that's cool. That's the LED light. It's a standing lamp, but you can direct those at the wall. That's, that's cool. Whatever. A little bit older wooden chairs in here. Some luggage. What's this thing? Curtain rod or shower shower rod. Okay. Mm hmm. This feels like one of those plastic organizers, but the tray's missing out of it. It's just odd. Odd. Uh, all right, so this right here, postal tub, guys. I get some comments that are kind of weird from you guys sometimes. Not, not you, not you watching this, but one of you of the tens of thousands of people that watch this, one of you or a few of you make weird comments about these saying, you better return those to the post office. That's a crime to use those. Hey guys, do you know how much mail that we mail every week? We mail tons of mail every week. We probably go through eight to 10 of these a week. We're constantly getting them from the post office. And uh, so have no fear, you guys, all you Karens out there. These will get re returned, but it will be returned with mail inside of it. Even better as far as I'm concerned for the post office. Don't worry, they'll be fine couple bags right there this is interesting i like it do you guys like this look at my little setup here we got the table bins garbage cans cart we're all set to go it is a little bit dark in this area but these lights right here give us a nice little unpacking station i say let's get started we're gonna get started with this right here actually let's get started with this right here mm -hmm. okay there's food and kitchen stuff it looks like a food pantry to me all right first bin first bin is not spectacular all right just getting a little pokesies here poking around oh i got some chunky light tuna for this chunky light locker nut right here ah uh, expires in 23 september of 23 that's just slightly expired okay a little food a little canned food what's this Hand sanitizer. All right. Yeah, we could use that. I'm going to put that aside. We may be needing that before long. Oh, my goodness. This is heavy. Oh, well, uh... <clears throat> Okay. Photos. We're going to get back to the owner. All right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. These partially used uh, cereal bags. Those can be dumped. This is a nice uh, thing right here. If you, if you eat cereal, one of these containers is very, very useful. Had those before. Okay. Okay. Coffee cup. It's new, I guess. Oats. Macaroni. Oh, something's coming out of that one. I'll get rid of that. More oats. Oh, look at all this hand sanitizer. Dang. It's brand new, I think. Back in the COVID days, that'd be worth a bit of money right there. Oh, look at this. Little box cutter. Put that aside too. Milk fat and milk. What the heck? That expired. That's just I'm not sure why someone would store the milk. Maybe that she wasn't planning on having her stuff in storage too long. Oh, that's nice. A little headlamp. Brand new. Okay. Never open. Oh, what's this? Reloadable card. Reboot card, it says. Huh. Fresh tea. More sanitizer. <laughs> And twigs you know they're probably spices or something it doesn't smell like anything Some water the stuff that's open before i'm gonna just go ahead and dump it pasta sauce 2023 hmm. all this stuff we'll take this to the flea market um it probably won't sell if it's expired but and by sell i mean we could even just give it 
away. Who cares? We'll give it away if somebody wants it. Oh, man, another heavy one. <laughs> He's way. Oh no, no, that's not good. Uh, bags of cat food, Valley Humane Society. What the heck? Mm -mm. This is not good. We don't want cat food. No. Maybe this will sell at the flea market, but I don't think so. What is this? Diamond maintenance. Is this cat food also? A modern diet inspired by nature. I think it's more cat food. No. No, 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 no. What's, what's the most concerning about the cat food to me, I think, is that it is very fragrant even through these bags. Um, and that is very, very dangerous for attracting rodents to your storage locker. Like, these are probably going to sit in my trailer for five or six days before we go to the market. And I'm, I'm a little bit worried about that. This is a weird locker already. Look at this Monopoly pieces from Safeway. <laughs> what else we got in here? There's some nice chones. Calvin Klein. Those are actually look some decent. I don't wear locker chones though, guys. No, 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 no. That, I draw the line somewhere. Uh, okay, there's a Malcolm X driven shirt, and that's a double XL. That's kind of cool, a little bit. I mean, that might sell at our vintage, not vintage market, but the upscale market. That might sell in. It might, it might, it might. It's worth bringing. Possible gift card siding. Go through that in a second. Bottles, uh -uh. knife block, there's some Apple headphones right here, that's decent, face mask, oh, wallet, guess, guess how much money's in here, <laughs> if you guess zero, you are correct, <laughs> there's nothing in here, oops, there's somebody's student ID in there, sorry dude, don't want to show that on YouTube to the world, it's a nice little wallet, not bad, not bad, it is leather, yeah, Whatever. Okay. Galaxy Rewards. Ooh, Target gift card. Not, not scratched. Rewards. Oops. Oh, maybe glue sticks or something. Club cards. Credit cards. Where's the gift cards? Amazon. I think those are already used up. Yeah, glue gun. Glue sticks go with the glue gun. Okay. Third box. Well, the good news is they're full because they're all been heavy so far. Bad news is, hmm, not been very good stuff. So here's a case of clip bars. That's kind of good. If they're not expired, it's good. Oh, where's the expiration? I don't see the expiration on this. Hmm. Aha. Uh -huh. November of 2020, dang it. That's that's really far gone. Oh, Pete's coffee. <laughs> More food. No. <laughs> Pasta might sell at the market. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No es bueno. What about peanut butter? Peanut butter doesn't go bad, does it? Hmm. 2021 on the cereals. 2022 on this. Oh my goodness, more. I don't know if that's, that's dog food, I think, not cat food. I think we're gonna be throwing a lot of stuff away from this locker. I only brought three small garbage cans. I think I'm gonna run out of garbage cans, so I might have to start using bags on this one. This stuff. How wasteful this is. Okay guys, we got a little bit of room here to walk in and work in this unit. Oh wait, something right here. Ooh, what is this? Oh, I thought maybe it was like a, a bow stick, you know, like for karate or something, like a weapon. Probably because I found all that karate stuff in the last locker. It is just a metal bar. Actually, it might be for working out, putting weights on it. I don't know. I don't know if it's a workout bar. Let's see what she tied up and covered in this bag here. Yeah, that's what this is. One of those little plastic organizers. I'm not sure why she felt the need to put that in the bag though. I don't get that at all. Not at all. But I might be able to use, reuse the garbage can, garbage bags. So, put it aside. 
Yeah, that's kind of nice right here. Look at that. Nice little workstation. Come over here and chicka chicka chicka. Gonna hang stuff right here and put some stuff up there. That's, that's pretty cool. Okay, a little bit lighter than the others, I think. Please don't be filled with food. Okay, this is this is different and already a little better because I, I can smell the laundry detergent. This is Steve Madden boots here. Woof, brand new. Let's go to the market. Huh? Brand new tax. Oh yes! Sweet! Homer Simpson, I mean the Simpsons, size medium, with tags, seven bucks at Kohl's, originally 14. Yeah, I'll just take that off. Now that's just at least a five dollar shirt, maybe a 10. That's cool, I like it. Okay, I also like all this, look at this. Bunch of sanitary wipes, I keep those in my car. Um, oh, Jana, you're gonna be happy. We got some laundry detergent. I think we may have just ran out at home. She, uh, Ran out and used my backup, which is out of a locker, and then I think used the backup up. So, and this is for newborns right here. That's probably pretty safe stuff. Snuggle. And snuggle. That's, that's some decent stuff. That'll save us a little bit of money. What's this, though? Ooh. Wet and wild. $10 value. Okay. But look at all of them. Oh, my goodness. Look at them all. Four of those. We got LA Colors, five dollars. LA Colors, five dollars. LA Colors, it's ten dollars. Crafted Imports, there's a very nice martini shaker. Huh, that's cool, stainless steel. Oh, there's another little Tide right there, nice. Glass drinking game. All right, one more wet and wild thing here, five bucks, brand new. New old, new stock, guys, new stock. What's this? Oh, what tags, huh? RBX, is that Reebok? Jogger pants, tapered. No price on it, but brand new, guys. No tags on this. CSG Large. Some nice sweat shorts right there. Those are cool, too. It's a good little box right here. I think I'm going to bring this whole box home. This stuff, maybe we'll just lock all that up and put it in our auction, our live auction. Maybe, perhaps. Or we'll just, I don't know, bring it to a better market. Okay, I think it's safe to say the bins are getting better. Next. All right. Got some clothes. This is this is good. Well, there's a shower curtain. <sighs> Took the tag out. Dang it. It's a nice sweatshirt. Pants. Nautica. That's decent sleepwear. Okay. Pajama bottoms. That's cool. Nike Air. Very nice. Good, 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 good. T-shirts sell very well for us. Nike sells very well for us. So Nike T-shirt. I think it'll sell well for us. Some active wear. It's good stuff. Brookfield uniforms. Oh, okay. If she's a postal carrier, there's a postal carrier's pants, uniform pants right there. Okay. And I say she because it was a woman. We did see the name before. Mossimo right there. I knew it was a woman's locker. Um, and I do believe she was a postal carrier because we found some links to uh, her name coming up on a postal carrier directory. Garage, Tokyo, Japan, spares and service. That's cool. 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 Couple good t shirts, but they're small. Size medium, I mean. Okay, here's another Nike shirt right here. That's cool. It's very soft. That one's a size large right there. Women's large, I think. No, maybe it's a men's large. That's a nice shirt. It's very soft. All right, and then look at these jeans. That's kind of cool. Jennifer Lopez. All right. Those will definitely sell at the market. Which market is the question? The cheapy, cheapy market or the little bit more upscale market? Or maybe it's a lot upscale market compared to the other. Oh, that's a neat apron. Look at that. That's a neat apron. I like it. Hmm. Very cool. I don't know why I think it's so cool. And then of course we're looking for some Levi's or something. Jennifer Lopez. Maybe they'll be buying that. I don't know. We'll try it. And recycled blues. Next box. Much lighter. Oh, plushies. Uh-oh. <laughs> this looks like decent ones too. Oh, this is a Grumpy Cat. Funny. Pokemon. Groot. There's a big Pokemon. This is some good stuff right here. I got some cat hair on here though, but not too much. There's uh, one of the Teen Titans, Cyborg. That's just a regular old stuffy. We don't need no regular stuffies. We want the nice stuffies. There's Minecraft with tags. Yeah. Well, there's a Pokemon. Cool, huh? Looks like Pikachu in a, some kind of outfit. Another little plushie. That one's kind of funny. 
Oh, what the heck? <laughs> Did not expect that. I'm not sure what the, what that, what, why put a uh, laser inside of a toy. It seems like kids are shining themselves in the eyes. I don't like, I don't necessarily like that. Party game here. Okay. Uh, there's another Minecraft, I think. I don't know, something. Yeah, I'll let that one go. And then look at this. A big old baby Yoda. Unfortunately, it's got kitty cat hair all over it, but that's still pretty cool. That's still kind of a neat one right there. Might be worth taking a lint roll or two and cleaning up. All right, well, what do you got here? Something for like gra uh, graduation ceremony probably, and this looks like maybe some diplomas. Uh, she took the diploma out though. Funny. San Jose State University. And this is a this is a De Anza College diploma here, and then there's a San Jose State diploma. Wow. Okay. San Jose, uh, De Anza, That's wait. That's really funny, isn't it? De Anza's, that's the junior college down Cupertino that we go to the flea market and we do pretty well at. It's just kind of funny, I think. Uh, there's the party game here. A party game for you and your stupid friends. All right, that's kind of funny. Funny. Ah, look at this. We found money, guys. Kiss my assets. And there's some dollar bills as part of, oh, look at that. She decorated her graduation uh, hat or whatever you call it, crown, hat, I don't know. Huh. I, might, I, might, I might be willing to take that apart, try to reclaim those dollar bills. I am that cheap. <laughs> look at this. Chanel number five, mirror, 10 bucks at Ross. That'll sell. Oh. That thing's kind of cool. Hmm. I think we can sell that at the market. Okay. Let's see. First backpack bag. Oh, I see shoes in here. There's a nice little bag. Kenex. Okay. Jessica Simpson shoes. All right. Pretty well worn. All right. The bag's kind of cool because you get, it's got the clear window. You can see what you got inside of it. Nautica. Is this sheets? I think it's sheets. What's this? Oh, wow. This is... Oh, geez, look at this, guys. Polo Ralph Lauren, brand new double XL sweatshirt, $125 tag on it. That's a really nice piece right there. Okay, there's a good find. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Love it. Okay, here's another one of those divider things in a bag. I don't understand the bag. Where's the drawers? Okay, we're back to very heavy, like full of books heavy. Uh, her canned food heavy, dang it. Never thought I'd say this, but I think I prefer books. <laughs> I never thought I'd say that. What's come to this? What's come to this? Mm -mm. Oh man, guys, that's not good right here. That's not good. Okay, clothes is better. Clothes is better than canned foods. What's this? San Jose State University, a little sweatshirt. Stance, I don't know, that's maybe a little bit more interesting. All right, let me go through this box, guys. It does look like all clothes, so let me go through it. I'll show you the good stuff. I'll sort it out. Oops, ah, dang, got more freaking canned food in the bottom, too. Okay, guys, not too much good stuff in there. And you see a, a fair amount of uh, canned food, just enough to give it some real weight. This 30 bucks right here on this little bag. Victoria's Secret. It's got like the eye goggles in one slipper, two pieces. Yeah, I, I'm aware. <laughs> I, just, I just didn't find the other piece. So maybe we'll find it. The fact they're brand new, uh, probably can sell that. These look like Lululemon right here. Lululemon makes it a little bit hard to find their brand though. Let's see. I think they might be Lululemon. There's this right here. If it is part of the logo fell off, it does kind of look like it. Oh wait, there it is. Barely see it. I think they have been worn quite a bit. That's a little lemon though. Those are expensive. I know the Nike shirt right here. It's very small. This is a kind of a wild one right here. Look at this. I'm not exactly sure what that is. Pretty cool. I mean, I don't know. It's not something I'd wear, but it looks like something they might pick up at the flea market. Junji Ito collection right here. Double XL. Pretty cool. And then the last piece is a nice sweatshirt. It feels like a nice quality. It says the Marathon right here. And it says Crenshaw. The Marathon clothing. So kind of cool. Last bin, or no, I'm of that stack. Okay. I don't see food yet, so that's 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 good. I'll take that. <laughs> Nike store bag right there. That's a nice bag. 
It's like she kept the bags from the nicer stores or something. 2021 calendar. I think we can let that go. Oh, oh, it's empty. Dang it, PlayStation controller box. Come on, PlayStation, where are you? Put that aside just in case we find it. Clothing, some ribbon, Merry Christmas ribbon. Here's the pillow. Okay, that sucks. <laughs> that's, that's not good find. USB Bluetooth adapter, empty. What the is this? I don't know. Toss. Oh, there is food in here, dang it. I thought I could smell some food, actually. PC gaming race. Finding gaming stuff, that's just a package right there, but finding gaming stuff, guys, that is a little encouraging. A little bit. Oh, empty box, what the heck? Oh, more cat food, jeez Louise. Powder Puff Girls, coin box. Have a ter terrific birthday. Oh, what's this? NBA, brand new, socks, four bucks. At Ross, yeah. some Apple thing. All right, dang it. All right, let's just go to the market, I guess. Next bin. Safeway receipt, that's not a good start. No, this, ooh, that looks like mold, and it is, because I just got a whiff of it. It's stinky, stinky. Oh, dang it. Oh, what's going on with this one? This one really stinks in here. Mm -mm. This one's got some straight up food, I think, in it. Like, there's condensation all in here, and it's moldy. But, oh man. What is that? Oh, <laughs> they had to put the freaking Chromebook in with the gross food. It's, oh my goodness, it's standing water at the bottom. Yeah, I'm just gonna let that one go. Yeah, that, yeah. yeah, that all sucks, but mm -mm, I'm not doing that. That's disgusting. Super gross. That one's gonna make me puke. I got, ugh. I just have that in my nose now. Okay. This one's a little bit lighter, so hopefully no food. Let's see what we got. Oh, I can still smell it. All right. It's so gross. Okay. You hear that? <laughs> it opens, but it doesn't go back. That elastic shot on that. I'll let those go. Too old. South Pole. And South Pole makes some nice clothes. It's not like a huge seller. It's not like big money, but it is nice quality. I've noticed that. American Stitch. I think that's decent too. Size small on this. Huh. Got some placemats here. Love. Some brand new. Table runners. Brand new. Yeah, those are cool. That's neat too. A little throw pillow. There's a little bit better stuff in here. Another brand new pull t uh, throw pillow. Five dollars brand new though, but whatever. We'll probably get two bucks in Stockton. Pegboard, t-shirt, little canvas pouches right here. Those are nice. Probably cheap, three bucks. But they're they are nice though. Number one love or pound love. I don't know, hashtag whatever. You know what I mean. More throw pillows. That's cool. Art display, little paper uh, clothes pins right there. Three dollars. Pillows, towels, little light box there. Follow your heart. That leads to some one dollar craft items here. LED lights here, five dollars. Dory stuff, three dollar book, stationery set it says. Ah. Oh. Nothing's terribly expensive. Usually when I find new, brand new stuff like this, there's some more underwears. I can like put it all in a, a nice size lot and sell it in our live auctions. But when you're starting with like dollar, two dollar, three dollar items, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Got some wine here. Cabernet Sauvignon. Okay. Tea fowl. Okay. More peanut butter. Uh, more food on the bottom too. Uh, more food. Mm -mm. Dang it. Saw the wine. Got a little excited about that. Looks like it's decent. Rodney Strong's decent. Louis Martini. This is good wine right here, I think. Rodney Strong. Yeah, that's good right here. Uh huh. I'm gonna put that aside. Nice plastic bowls right here. Look at this guy. That is nice. This is very nice. Kind of like that. I'm gonna bring that to the better flea market. Just because. Maybe we can get five bucks. Um, there's that's a PS4 right there, guys. What the heck? I see only this food until it's like. Oh wait, there's a PS4 right on top. Oh. Oh my goodness, it's so heavy. It's 
might be the heaviest one yet. Okay, that is a good find right here. PS4. Yeah. Okay, the good, 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 good. So we're gonna pull that, put in this little box down here. This is where we can put in our better stuff. There's a PS4 controller. What is this? Ascend. That's probably a pretty expensive mouse right originally. I'm gonna put that box aside. Again, maybe we find it, you know? Okay, look at this. LG phone, it's a little cracked up at the top. Okay, uh-oh, that's good. T84 Plus, there's 30, 40 bucks right there. All day long. Oh wait, is that the Hyper? That's the, that's the mouse, right? No. Wait, is it? No, different. Brand new compass, little basketball, Kobe Bryant. 2016 Panini, what the heck? Postage notes, I'm finding all kinds of great stuff. And there's tons of junk mail. Acrylic paint set there, Artist Loft. There's some good gloves, Hyperflex. I'll put that aside in case I find more moldy stuff. There's a, uh, some toilet paper. That's, sometimes that's very important at the flea market. The milk I'm just gonna dump. It's so far past expiration. I don't think anyone's gonna wanna take a chance on that. Look at this. It's cans, canned food, and then underneath there's a ton of, I don't know, the paperwork and stuff, but what's this, La Visa? There's, it's empty, but what if there's something good at the bottom? Dang it, now I'm gonna have to go through everything. I'm gonna have to take all this food out and uh, go get to the bottom, because I can't, I can't take a chance. There's maybe, hey, what's this? Mamba, 5%? I don't know what that is. Puffs, Puffs Plus. I think some kind of tobacco thing or maybe or something, I don't know. Uh, all right, unfortunately, it's just receipts and junk mail. Um, but at least this looks a little better when we consolidated it all. It looks more clean. Okay, now we're into stuff that's not totes. Let's see if we can find a little better. Oh, not yet. <laughs> Not, not seeing it yet. This is looking pretty terrible. Oh, what? You see that? Wait a second. Okay, wait a second. Let me make sure I shake all this off good enough. Because look what we got at the bottom here. Oh, okay. I don't think it's anything, but hmm. That little piece looks like it could be 10K or something. Not the chain, I would say. But that's kind of decent. All right. Let's see what's in here. Nothing. Oh, look at this Cafe Du Monde. That's in New Orleans. Coffee and sh chicory. New Orleans, Louisiana. That's kind of neat. They've got the world famous beignets. She like ties up her bags into little balls. Very organized. Very unnecessary. <laughs> huh, I don't know what that's for. What's this? Cacti. Agave spiked seltzer. Huh. Spiked with what? Spiked with what? That's what I want to know. That's kind of interesting. I saw a couple of those. Ooh, look at this. I just bought some of this. Uh, that one's already open. I'm not going to use that, but I just bought some of that. That's actually pretty good. This is mostly garbage. Dang it. Okay. Let's grab another bag and get to the bottom of it. Quite literally. Oh, United States Army. Nice. Empty. Whoa, whoa, okay, okay, yeah, that is pretty cool, you know what that's for, right guys, comment below if you know what that is, alright, oh, heck yes, restricted law enforcement, government use only, I don't know why she had that working at the post office, <laughs> that is very interesting, exciting find right there, some little brackets, Brackets and screws, brackets and screws. Decent whistle. Huh, I don't, I don't, I don't see the brand. This feels like a nice jacket. Like super, super um, thick. The cold weather for sure. Check pockets. Check a hidden pocket. Huh. Uniqlo, Uniqlo, Q L O, size medium. That is a rather nice jacket. I think we might need to take that to the better market. Give it a chance. 
Dang, that was that was kind of an exciting bag right there. I ain't gonna lie. I liked it. I liked it a lot. That's oh, a backpack bag too. Look at that. With uh, wheels. That is a weird thing to store right here. Okay. Oh no. Oh no. I have a feeling this is all bags. It's a box of bags. Wait, 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 wait. Never mind. Jeez. Oh my word. Not more junk mail. Come on. I guess if you think about it, a <laughs> postal employee keeping junk mail. I don't know. Maybe it's kind of poetic. All right. Now that we've got the bins out, we, we can see a little bit further back in. And I see mostly boxes. And this one looks like clothes. So that's a little better. It's not great, but it's a little better. That one looks like clothes too. Hmm, guys, I'm hoping we find some better stuff in here. Honestly, I was hoping that maybe we find some handbags in here. Uh, that might be... It might be wishful thinking, but oh, there's another postal bin. <laughs> this one says hangers and baby shoes. Oh, that's mm -mm. okay. This this is a curtain right here. I think I thought it was a shower curtain, but there's so many curtains. These are all curtains, all different wild colors. Robe hook right here. And a couple of them. More curtains. Very strange because they're all different colors. And in that bag was entwined a whole bunch of curtain rods there <laughs> so I don't know I've never seen a house decorated with so many different colored curtains but maybe it's a thing okay this uh whoa this right here is packing paper we use that we'll use it there's a little party mailbox we'll use that too just now we don't use them unfortunately there's no use for that What's this? pens little calculator Highlighter, hand sanitizer, yeah, whatever. These organizers, that'll, that'll probably sell. And there's some uh, Lysol wipes, I might put those aside. Yeah. Miracle Grill, okay, I'm gonna let that go, it looks old. Uh, oh no, bunch of medication, that's not good. It's no value, and yeah, a little bit more. Ah, man, this thing's got a nick in the top right there. Otherwise, I'd say that was okay. Sellable, but no. The next bag. We'll get some garbage bags in here. Maybe we can use those. We got so much garbage. This is receipts and tags and stuff. What the heck? Why keep this stuff? Why? 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 Tell me why. Okay, maybe this actually is a garbage box. I mean bag, garbage bag. Garbage bag filled with garbage. There's uh, plenty of garbage bags. That's sellable. Next bag's got some blankets and looks like uh, floor mats, bath mats or something. Comforter. Next box. Ooh, what's this? Got a little wallet right here. Princess Leia. Oh, Star Wars wallet. Ah, no money. That is a cool wallet, though. That is... I've never seen one like that. That's kind of neat. A little different. Oh, my goodness. More medication. <laughs> Wallpaper or shelf liner or something. Uh, hmm. Kind of neat. A little bit neat. Sort of neat. And it's just plates. Plates. Plates, 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 plates. And some cookware. Okay, first look at the chairs. Kind of interesting. Definitely an older look, older chair. It's got like almost like a musical feel to it. And I think this is very neutral. That should match a lot of different people's interiors. There's two. Looks like three, four. A minimum four of those. I'd be interested to see if the dining table's in here as well. Okay, this was underneath the chairs. Oh, it's a bummer. I was, hoping, <laughs> I was hoping for some wine. Got more expired canned food. What about this one? Oh, look at this. Brand new with tags. $12.49. But still, anything with tags is going to sell a little better. Guess. A little halter top. Zara. Brand new shoes right here. Those look kind of nice. Wild Fable. And bra. Okay, let's get this down. Uh -huh. 
Okay, a couple more postal bins up there. Down there, unfortunately, we uncovered that, and there's cat food in that one. That's not good. Not good. Oh, this is decent. Look at that. They look like they're almost brand new. Cloud foam comfort. Whoa, 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 whoa. Brand new. Brand new on these. Whoa. That's a good find. Wait, 10 bucks? What the heck? How can those be 10 bucks? How is that 10 bucks? I don't understand that. These have got to be more than that. Size 8. I'm hoping one of my ladies at home, Jana or one of the girls, wears a size 8 because... Okay, that's good. And here's some more. These ones are just slightly worn. These are super light too, guys. Just like it says... Uh, I mean, that's not clickbait. Oh, brand new ones. Cloud form. They do... They feel light as clouds. I mean, that's probably why they called it that. And you guys were like, yeah, no dead, Jack. That is obviously why they called it that. Oh, Birkenstocks. 19 bucks where is she buying this stuff that's a freaking steal that's a steal but where are they where is it nautica sleeping shorts right here four bucks what a deal she is she's shopping somewhere and getting some deals i'm taking that off mark new york what brand new tags nightgown that's what, those are nice. Nautica. Maybe I'll bring those to the better market. Doesn't matter if she paid four. They're still Nautica. Two bucks? I'm, we might have to look this lady up and ask her where she's getting these clothes at at that price. Because that's like cheaper than thrift store price. And it's brand new. Voyager. Look at that. Stretch fabric. That's a nice shirt. And it is stretch. It's no clickbait. It is stretch. Size extra large. Actually, I might pick that side. Maybe I'll wear that. I'll wear it to church on Sunday. These are soft. Jane and Bleeker. Brand new tags. Oh no, actually, I don't know if it's brand new. These are six bucks. That's pretty expensive. I can't believe she paid up so much. Just kidding. They are nice though. Those are nice. Hmm. Another extra large here. Weatherproof vintage. I found this stuff before. This weatherproof vintage. They make nice stuff too. Hmm. Long sleeve. Levi's. Right here. Signature. Signature is not quite the same. She paid ten bucks on that. But these are brand new tags. See if I can get ten bucks. I'll be happy with ten bucks. Yeah, this is a this is a good box right here. Oh, look at this. This scale works. Give scale a quick sharp tap here, and it's working. Hmm. I might bring it home. My scale sucks. My scale at home sucks. It does not keep an accurate tab. And I'm not just saying that just because it keeps going up every time I get on it. I'm saying it because it really doesn't keep an accurate number. It's inconsistent. You get on and get off and get on and get off, get on and get off. It gives you three different reads. Sometimes as much as three pounds apart. Um, Lee right here. Jogger, rugged knee. Size large. Those, those are good too. Jeez. Those are women's, right? 14, 16? Hmm. Again, I'll see if any of my family wants it. Gloria Vanderbilt jeans right here. Brand new with tags. She paid two dollars. Wow. Two dollars for Gloria Vanderbilt. Brand new with tags. All right, now. What is this? Oh wow, Pumas, brand new. Brand new, never worn. Soft foam, Pumas. Again, she paid eight bucks on that. Crazy, crazy deal. Seven and a half on these. Okay, well there's some very, very good shoes right here. The cat food's got me kind of conflicted because I started feeling like, okay, maybe all the kitchen and food was in the black and yellow totes. And maybe this does better, but the cat food suggests, nope, the nightmare's not over. Oh, these are nice. These are nice. 10 pound dumbbells right here. Ooh, yeah. Feel the burn, feel the burn. Where can I put these? Put these right in. I'm gonna take those home. That was a hu huge, this box says huge box for the two dumbbells. That's kind of funny. Hangers and baby shoes. Okay, but they're not just baby shoes, are they? They're vans. Oh my goodness, this is pretty awesome. Those are nice. Yep. Air Jordans, oh my goodness. Oh, those are so cool. Those, as what do they call asphalt or something? Those are sweet. Okay, size four. 55 bucks, wow. It's been a while, but I have sold baby Jordans on eBay before. These ones are used. Those are pretty gross, actually. I'm going to leave those go to Stockton. I know they love the Air Jordans out there, too. 
Oh, nice Timberlands. Brand new Timberlands. Awesome. Okay. Oh, wow. There's a... Okay, almost looks brand new, but it's not. Nice fan, though. 10-inch fan. Battery powered. Ooh, dang. There's <laughs> still a little chocolate in that. Okay, we got some clothes. There's a little Minecraft for kids. There's some Wranglers right here. Jeans. Those are kind of nice. Nice. Nice enough to put aside for the better market, right? You guys know what I'm talking about at this point, I think. Some NBA shorts right there. Extra large. Those are kind of nice. And this is some good stuff in here. It looks like it needs to be laundered, though. It needs to be washed. Oh, that's like Notorious B.I.G., I think. Set on a king card, excursion. All right, it needs to be washed, but whatever. California Bears right there. Berkeley sweatshirt, champion. Nike Thermofit right here. That's cool. I think I've said it before, guys, but if you haven't heard me say it, uh, I don't get really that excited about clothes, but clothes, there's eyes on. Clothes sell for me. So anything that sells, anything that produces the money, you know, the return on our investment, that makes me a little bit more interested World Without Thieves, brand new right here, sealed. Ooh, what's this? Oh, this is heavy. What is this? That's a little iPhone. An old iPhone right here. Smashed, unfortunately. Oh, yeah, that's been in there a long time. Old iPhone. Hmm. That's pretty cool. This might have a little bit of value. The originals. The collectible. There we go. Adidas. That is pretty sweet. Oh, yeah. Size large. More Jennifer Lopez. I guess I'll put them aside. I put the other ones beside. Gotta stay consistent, I guess. There's a Nike shirt. Pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, if people are buying clothes and we're making money off clothes, I get excited to find clothes, the good clothes. But I understand it's not like the best is fine. It's not like we're getting super excited about it, but whatever. Gotta make that money. Okay, guys. Getting it cleaned out. I took the two chairs off there and made a trip to the to the car, the van. I got the van today, so um, I think I could. I I, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I think I could almost fit this all in one load, but then I look at what's out here and it's like eh, I don't know. Van doesn't fit that much, and I don't want to get too crazy with packing it. We're right in Pleasanton, which is like two towns over from me, so it's like super easy to get here. I probably just come tomorrow and finish this off, but I think we go through it all today. Let's grab this one right here. This one, eh. mm, I don't know. I was kind of curious about that one, but not so much now, but let's grab it. Okay. That was the thing I thought, oh, maybe there's something good in there, but nope, there's not. It's too bad the year to use that, because I'm going to use some good uh, deodorant right now. Hmm. Oh, Black Panther? No, Spider-Man of some sort, I don't know. Some shoes. Ego shoes just kind of randomly mixed in with all this stuff. Conditioner. Suave. All right, it's looking like uh, bathroom stuff. Clothing mixed in with, oh yeah, there's a United States Postal Service shirt. That's funny. Clothes mixed in with bathroom products. A little random. This stuff will sell though. The brand new soap, that'll sell. They all, seem to always be looking for that at the market. Hand soap. Oh, there's some money. Holy smokes, there's a lot of money. Good thing I pulled that clothes out. Alright, well, whatever. There's like 35 cents. I'll take it. Let's see what this is. Just want to make sure I don't pass up any Victoria's Secret stuff because that stuff can resell for decent money. Uh, I don't see any tags on it. That's a nice piece of nightwear right there. Okay. Two more postal bins and on top right here is a electric skillet. Oster electric skillet. It looks like a, maybe a little baby bullet or something here. A little mixer. What's this? Farberware. Yeah, a little mixer. That's cool. The, these will sell at the market. Those are those are good sellers usually. Okay. Top of this one's kind of crushed. Oh, what's this? Okay, it's mostly bags. This bottle. <laughs> Hand sanitizer. And this thing here. This is weird. It's just weird. Oh boy. And some bottled water. Okay, <laughs> this is funny. They got felt on them. They're felt pencils. It's kind of funny. And kids' jacket. A little bit of clothes here. We knew it was clothes. We just wanted to take a look at what they are. What's this? Puma. Oh, but listen to this. Uh huh. Those are dumb. Uh, these are kids' clothes here. Lego Star Wars. That's a decent kid clothes right there. Put that to the better market. 
Las Vegas. So, oh, bought some cool t-shirts for the kids. That's neat. <laughs> Las Vegas, okay. Oh, that's kind of neat for the kids too. Well, whatever. Hmm, <laughs> four leaf clover in the shape of skulls there. Or made out of skulls, I mean. That's kind of neat. All right, next bin looks just like that bin, but it's a different bin. Oh, little jacket. Oh, oh, <laughs> I like he. Yeah, Michael Kors. We love Michael Kors. Michael Kors is the this, this stuff. I almost said something else. It's the stuff. I said that I was really hoping maybe to find some handbags in here. First one that we found, that's a beautiful little piece too. Great condition. Really not, not really any signs of wear. That's fantastic guys. That is something that we'll definitely be putting in our live auction. And that's what I'm looking for, stuff for the live auction. You know what I'm talking about live auction? I'm talking about what not. That's the place to be if you want to buy the things that you see. Oh, I made a rhyme. I didn't even mean to. That's cool. Spider-Man pajama bottoms. Kind of like that. I don't know. I don't, that's not a $10 item, but it might be a $5. I don't know. That's, whatever. I'll bring it to the better market. We're not really looking for $5 items in here. We're looking for the better stuff. Michael Kors purse, come on. That's Give us give us a shout about that. That's good. That's what I'm looking for. We want the good stuff. This bin right here is the best stuff, and it's not even like that good until we found the Michael Kors. Well, the PS4 is pretty good. But these better items, that's what we're going to put into the live auctions or whatnot. That's a live streaming app that is for your phone and tablet and computer too if you really want to. But I suggest the phone and tablet. You can enter giveaways that way. <laughs> um, and we do giveaways. We find some fun stuff and give it away, you know in these lockers We're looking for some fun stuff too it doesn't have to be like valuable or collectible but that's really what we want to find and put up for sale it starts at a dollar guys we don't we don't know what it's going to sell for we put it at a buck you guys determine how much it sells for it depends on how many bids i mean almost every week we sell something for a buck and that's not you know that's not <laughs> that's never our intention we want to make some money too you know there's some levi's no lucky brand oh nice I like Lucky Brand jeans, I do, I do. But yeah, we're trying to find that good stuff. I wanna find the jewelry box. I wanna find the collectibles. Put it up for sale, starting at a dollar. You guys get some deals. You can pick up some great stuff. You know what's cool about when we buy the storage lockers and you guys can buy the best stuff is that some of that stuff, like they never really intended it to be for sale. What is this right here? I think this is like a body wrap. Almost feels like Hawaii to me. I'll put that aside because I like it. It's stuff that, you know, they probably wouldn't have put out their garage sale sometimes. It's stuff they put in storage that they wanted to keep. Not always, but sometimes. That one's falling apart right there, so that we won't put in whatnot. Heck no. Monday night we had a whatnot auction. We sold a ton of stuff, and we had a ton of silver jewelry, so that was a big, big exciting part of our auction on Monday. But another exciting part of the auctions, guys, is if you haven't signed up for whatnot yet, and you use my link... And that link is in the description of this video. It's also on our website, LockerNuts.com. You can find it there anytime. You can also find our next upcoming auction. Like, you know, like when's your next auction? Go to our website, LockerNuts.com. You'll find out very easily. There's a nice volleyball. More importantly, there's a very nice basketball. All right, that's cool. Uh, I think that's a yoga mat right here. It's an empty box right there. A couple books. Oh, look at this. People's choice, huh? I think these are for your back. I think you roll on these to stretch yourself out. Uh, I might be wrong, but I think that's what that's for. Yeah, go to our website, hit that link. You'll get $15 off just for signing up. But you do have to use the link. If you don't use the link, you won't get the sign up. And then you'll be messaging me saying, I didn't get my $15. You gotta use the link, guys. I can't say it enough. You gotta use the link. You gotta use the link. Here's a nice backpack with one of those bladders in it. You can suck water while, like, while you're running or biking. Jump ropes. And this is another, some yoga thing right here, right? I think it's the same logo. I think it's for like stepping or something. I don't know. People's choice. Speaking of people's choice, guys, whatnot is the people's choice for live auctions. 
<laughs> if you haven't been, really go check it out. You'll see what I mean. You'll see why we talk about it in like every single video, why we put all our best stuff there for sale. You'll see what I mean, and you'll thank me later. All right, look at me getting all excited because I found a Michael Kors. <laughs> and then I started talking about auctions. This one says, what does it say? Jackets, but this is, uh, I don't know what that says. But, hmm. Shoes and toys, it looks like. Captain America. Hmm. It's weird to put your women's shoes in with the children's toys, I think. It's weird. Well, those are cool. Converse. <laughs> Angry Birds. Oh, look at these. With Harley Quinn on it. Converse. Those are kind of neat. Sunscreen. Breeze. I'm definitely gonna have to transfer this into a different box because we're gonna have to go through the whole thing okay guys I sorted out all the shoes there was quite a few shoes and I don't really see anything too interesting in here so I guess we'll just make that a toy box and then this one right here is now a shoe box I didn't find any other cool shoes either the Harley Quinn's the only ones we put aside next big box here Some office supplies, sticky notes will take. A little bit of clothes, pack so, and those are kind of nice. A little bit of plates and stuff. Clothes, 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 clothes. Weird. Clothes and plates mixed in together. Some more Jennifer Lopez jeans. Some Lululemon lookalikes. Ugh. Handmade in Italy. Okay, wait a second. Now this is kind of this. Way. I thought it was leather, it's not. I think it's pleather. Let's see what it says. Uh, maybe not. Huh. I don't see anywhere what the, the material, but it, I don't know. It's a nice jacket, though. I think it's not leather, it's pleather. More stinking medicine. I don't think she was taking her medication. I think that's why there's so much of it. <laughs> a little bit of pajamas. Empty box. Notebooks in. Oh. <clears throat> Look at these guys. These are at the bottom of this paperwork bag right here. And, um, oh, they look designerish. It says Frame Italy. Frames made in Italy right here. I don't see a maker though. And I think they are, for, oh, they are definitely prescription. But those look kind of fancy. I'll put them aside okay here's where we're at now uh got a lot of stuff out but man, it's just not looking better <laughs> this thing though you know i do like these things usually maybe 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 this looks kind of interesting the top one <sighs> mm -mm. no nope. oh, what have we got in here <laughs> oh, oh got a little bong inside of a plastic container there <laughs> All right, got a little quilt there. Nope. Peanut butter. A little kid's outfit. Don't care. This one, maybe. All right, let's get this out. Oh, I don't know about these ones, though. I just need one box of handbags or maybe a jewelry box in here somewhere. We'll be good. But otherwise, guys, this one is rough. Rough, rough, rough. Sunscreen, okay. And this is a empty box, dang it. Dollar fifty on that. It's actually pretty cool. Belt bag. It almost feels like a dry bag. Feels like a waterproof material here. That's kind of neat though. Dollar fifty. It should not have been dollar fifty. Seven dollars though. Very new. Triple A. Couple little Kleenexes here. Yeah, kid stuff right here. Uh oh, my cuticle clipper nipper. It's a nipper, not a clipper. Come on, locker nuts. Don't you know your clippers and nippers? Nope. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> cheep, cheep. Mm. Poop. It's poop. I tell you, it's all poop. All right, we got this big, big box. It's so big. I didn't want to wear the chest cam because it won't. It's taller than me. 
Just kidding. It's just not that big. I'm just kidding. I'm playing with you guys. But it looks like it's all closed. Boring. So boring. It's kids' clothes. It's even more boring. And I'm getting bored. I do see some tags though. 1899. There's more tags right here. CBR. Kind of bored, guys. Transfer time. I'm just going to transfer and see if we see anything exciting. That looks kind of interesting. I'm sure her clothes are going to sell in Stockton because they're not bad. They're just not super high end. So I don't think I'll be able to get like 10 bucks or more per piece at the better flea market. So we'll just let the stuff go to Stockton where people pay no more than one or two dollars per item. You try to get anything more than that is seriously a, a lesson in frustration because you won't you won't be able to sell it very very rarely you might if you had like an amazing piece like a leather jacket for example five to ten bucks hopefully usually all right i thought that was a kind of a neat sweatshirt i was wrong back to this i got some socks but it, this is this gal that's what she does with her socks she puts them together as a pair i like that it'll make it easier to sell this stuff here it's a nice little dress but this is more of the underwears department that's why they were in the bag and yeah, I don't, I'm not seeing, I'm not seeing stuff of, again, significant value. There's Forever 21, 18 bucks brand new, and it is brand new. Two bucks in Stockton. Okay, guys, next, whatever, this is a garbage bag, but, um, it's looking a little bit better. A little, little, little bit better. I don't know, brand new t-shirt, five bucks. That's not what I'm talking about. Oh, I thought we had Birkenstocks. We almost had a Birkenstocks by White Mountain Cliffs right here. Those are brand new, brand new. It's almost like some garbage in here too, though. Rubber bands. Thank you cards. That's cool. Some little ribbons. A little polishing mitt. I think uh, this is oh, the, the, the Velcro is messed up. I'm sorry, the elastic's messed up. It's too bad. That's for like your car. Whatever. Um. Almost looks like some jewelry. It is a little bit of jewelry. It's a little tiny bit of jewelry right here. Huh. Not much to see, guys. There's a couple earrings in there, but we'll take that home. Check for gold. Sports bra. Puma. Sports bra. Union Bay. Pants. Okay, look at these. These are kind of neat. They're Goodyear. Like, they make the tires, you know? Brand new. Never worn. Hiking boots. $27 at Ross, so those aren't cheapy cheap. If you guys can't tell, I'm kind of losing my enthusiasm a little bit for this locker. There's a lot more garbage than I thought. When you see the black and yellows, you think, oh, this person cares about their stuff. You don't think, oh, they're going to throw their whole pantry, including liquids, in there and let everything get moldy. Empty boxes, garbage. You know, you really do think better stuff. Just wasn't there. Not this time. Amber Crombie and Fitch right here. That's a... Small jacket, but it's nice. Medium. Hmm. Seems like the zipper is jammed. Not releasing. I'll let it go to Stockton. Check the pockets. Nothing. Empty. More brand new stuff. Clearance. 11 bucks. Hats. Sports bras, decent stuff. Ooh, Columbia. Uh-oh. Oh, that's, look at that, long shirt. Very long shirt. In Columbia, six bucks she paid. Huh. That's definitely going the better market. Brand new Columbia, come on. Dan skin, brand new, four bucks she paid. Okay, look at this, Aldo. $8.99 for this thing right here. Jewelry, she bought it on sale again. Surprisingly cheap. I don't know, Aldo's decent, isn't it? I think it's okay. I don't really know, but that's a good find out. That'll make it to our live auction. A little jewelry. Ah, there's a Canada hat right here. That's kind of nice. A couple of them. This is like a shoe organizer, but she's got all kinds of stuff in here, including more medication, more pills, more medication. Oh, 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 Ray-Bans. Okay. Oh, those are nice. Look at that, you guys. There's a good find. Nice, that's really nice. Look at those, Janamite dibs those. All right, that makes me happy. Another good find. 
<laughs> That's in the shoe organizer. So random. There's another photo. Okay. There's like random receipts thrown in with clothes too. I don't know what that is. Keska Village? Oh, it takes a village. Oh my goodness. I don't know why. I saw like Alaska and I'm thinking, I don't know what I'm thinking. There's like yellow jacket. Must be, I don't know what that stands for. Kind of cool. I'll put it aside. <laughs> it tests a village. Oh wow. Locker nuts. What's wrong with you? Some eyelashes. If, you, if you're missing your eyelashes, I guess. What's that? There's an LED bulb. Dimmable. Huh. Cool. Oh, Oops. gloves. What's in here? Okay, light bulb, <laughs> light bulb <laughs> in this really nice pouch right here. Not what I would have thought it was. A little headlamp. Mm. More medication. All oh, right, there's the other knockoff Birkenstock right there. Sixteen dollars at Ross on sale. Another headlamp, Defiant. Actually, these look brand new, so I'm gonna put those aside. Okay. What do we got here? Oh. Flume, strawberry banana. What is this stuff? Uh oh. See some marijuana leaves on here. What is this stuff? I don't know what this stuff is. Flume. They appear to be uh, depleted wherever they are. So it's like she kept all her old stuff, all the packaging and all the containers. So weird, right? So weird. All right, that's just all gonna go in the garbage. Hmm. Look at this thing, you guys. Um, this big old like crock pot broiler or something. I don't know what it is, but it's got this little weave right here. And it says 100% human hair. Found human hair in a locker. That is creepy. <laughs> yeah. Yep. 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 Huh. Hmm. Maybe it'll sell. We'll find out. <laughs> Weird. Way of packing. Okay, next bag, next bag. Dirty rag, face mask. All right, oh, that's cool. Look at this, United States Postal Service, guys. I told you she was a postal carrier. All right, very cool. I think it's cool. Yeah, this stuff's not looking that good right here. These clothes are dirty and older and mm-mm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-mm. It's a nice cushion right there. That's very soft. Samsonite, oh my goodness. That's kind of nice right here. It'd be comfortable. That's a nice one. <laughs> Ow. These clothes are gross in here. This towel has gum stuck in it. I, I want to show you guys that. I mean, it's food. I don't know what it is. That's gross. That's gross. All right, next bag. Oh, yes. Birkenstocks. Right there. Boom, baby. Two. Nice. 39. Could that be my size? Oh my goodness. That's pretty dang close. They might be like half a size too big. I love Birkenstocks. I will spend most of the summer in Birkenstocks. That is how I roll. These are cool. The vans are cool. These are not. These are thrashed. Ah, oh, bummer. Only one of the Pumas. Maybe we'll find the other one. Alright, guys. Next box. And look what we got here. USPS certified socks. Got a couple brand new socks right there. That's kind of neat. I don't know. Oh, yeah, that's cool. Small size, but um, it says size large. It must be a women's large or a kid's large, but it's NASA space shuttle. I like it. Just a t shirt there. Just a plain white shirt. What's this one? It says Chiefs. There's another pair of socks. What's this? K A P P A. And that feels a little bit nicer quality. I don't know if you can see that, but it's got like this logo right here. It's a couple ladies. Uh, oh, look at the knees are worn out though. They got a hole in the knees. That's too bad. These feel like they could be probably something better because they're, you tell it's good quality. <laughs> Croft and Barrow, brand new sweater. Christmas sweater. That's a nice piece. $55 at Kohl's. On sale for $5.50. 90% off. L-O-G-G -G, log from H&M. This is a very soft sweatshirt right there. CSG large right here. It's a big stain. Bummer. <laughs> I need some space. It's got a little helmet, space helmet. This was some 14 karat plated jewelry, but it's gone. Little bag. 
fleshy. Oh, what's this? It's one of those socks right here. Some more uh, uniform pants for post office. Come on, Lululemon. Nope, 90 degree. Oh, that's a cool one, though. Punisher hat. Marvel. I still like my post office hat, though. I hope you guys can see this. What is this? Happy Mother's Day. Okay. So that's some ornaments. Cava San Lucas. Little turtles. Oakland Athletics. A little baseball. What's in here? Yeah. That's cool. A little Mickey Mouse medal. Disney. I think it's an ornament. That's cool. Sea salts. Peace and quiet. Okay. Whatever. Gift set. Look at this box, guys. I have not been taping the last few boxes because one was food and like two of them were just all clothes. So, um, but look at this organic cotton tampons. Here's a uh, flat iron. Okay. Look at all of this brand new stuff. Scope. Scope. There's tons of mouthwash. Tons of mouthwash. I guess she bought it. Maybe she was like one of those extreme couponers or something. There's some dryer sheets. We'll put that aside. We'll use that. And towels down here pretty cool right pretty cool this will sell what do you think two bucks each two 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 i don't know it's not that much this one's getting kind of interesting look at this just towels and clothes dirty pillow but this right here little piece of jewelry i think little necklace i don't think it's gold but it is very i don't know it's pliable i don't think it's gold but would definitely have to take it back and look at it these i think are more of those body wraps right here this is a scarf this is another scarf. This is this feels nice, and it almost looks like it's got that. Uh, it's got a, some writing on it. This might be a designer piece. I don't know. But then look at this, guys. Another Michael Kors right underneath that. Another Michael Kors. So our second handbag of the evening or day. <laughs> no signs of wear on that Michael Kors. That's a beautiful one right there. Very very nice. I was really hoping I could find some piece of clothing that would be like. That says Amazing Grace. So I was hoping to find something that's like higher end, you know, designer, Gucci, Chanel, something. Just like one piece, you know, you think that she'd have like one piece, but um, I haven't found it. I haven't found it, unfortunately. These body wraps are kind of interesting. I'm going to put those aside in the nicer scarves. See what Gianna thinks about that stuff. Okay, here's the next box starting out with an electric toothbrush box. No electric toothbrush, just a box, just a box. This looks like kind of a nice comforter right here. Nice looking. Oh yeah, what's this, what's this? Lenovo laptop, oh, Chromebook right here. Oh nice, okay, at least we got one Chromebook that's not all ruined. It's pretty nice, looks good. Good, 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 good. Good, good, good. Sharpie pen. There's a, a Honeywell fan, maybe heater too, I don't know. That's a pretty good find. Those always sell at the market, especially with summer coming up. We're just getting in spring right now. Pork and beans. There's a sports bra right here. Surprisingly, it's $12.99 at Ross. Morera. Seems kind of high, in my opinion. We've got it all. Actually, we don't. We don't have the treasures. Okay, guys, next box. And things are getting interesting right on top. Check this out. We've got some Pokemon cards. They're a little rough, maybe? Because they're just thrown in here. But, um, so what? They're Pokemon cards. I think it says 2018. Those are not terribly old. And then look at this. PlayStation 2. Oh, uh, empty. <laughs> huh. These are good. <laughs> Never give up hope, right, guys? Don't give up hope. Pokemon are definitely items that we will sell in our live auctions. People actually come to the live auctions and request Pokemon. It's probably our number one requested thing. Oh, Xbox 360 prototype. PlayStation 2. Oh, Gran Turismo 3, it's there. A little scratched up. PlayStation 2, it's not there. Another Pokemon. Madden 16, but it's not that, right? That's wrestling, but whatever. Some Costco cards here. I don't. I think that's when you return stuff, you get these credit cards. Or you know what I mean. Credit goes on those cards. I'm gonna have to take those home and check them out. Bunch more Pokemon. Yeah. 
Little Hot Wheels. Yeah, there's a charge uh, power cord for an Apple, specifically an Apple. I think a, probably an Apple laptop. Oh, this, a, this looks like a lot of funky junk in here. Though. Okay, there's a couple phones. This one says Moto on it. The screens are looking pretty good too. So there's that's decent. That aside, cards right here. Christmas cards. Transformers uh, notepad. Cooling towel. Oh, this is one of those ones you put around your neck. Those are very useful right around summertime, you know? Oh my goodness, this thing is super hard and it's been used. <laughs> I'm sure it'll soften up when it's wet, but whatever. Yeah. Pokemon. Another phone. Wicko. Bought something at Costco probably. There's another phone. A little one. There's another Pokemon at the bottom. Fennekin. That's a holographic card too. Let's see what's in here. This looks like a little bit more personal stuff in here maybe. We'll get that back there. Okay guys, we're getting down the last couple boxes. Look at this. Right there. That's the Xbox One right there. Xbox One. That is great. Great. So we found a PS4 and now we found Xbox One. Those are kind of comparable. Whoopsie. Those are kind of comparable machines. Power cord, very important. Dang, I spilled the Scrabble game, unfortunately. Um, this is tape shut right here. Build a gingerbread house. That's not a good sound. Mom, locking up's making a mess. Just got Elf on the shelf. Projection Plus. This is twenty dollars right here. Projects this stuff on the house. Christmas time. This is a fifty-eight dollar one. Yeah, that's what it is. Huh. Maybe I'll put those aside. I don't know. Those little projectors. Those might be a good auction item. Why not? All right, guys. I just finished the last box right there. Kitchen mats, an old used curry, and a couple empty bags. <laughs> yeah, there was quite a few boxes that were not very exciting at the end there, which is why I didn't show it. I, as I said earlier, I lost my enthusiasm a little bit for this locker, guys, but I didn't lose my enthusiasm for sharing the best finds. We showed you all the good finds. So there was a couple at the end, right? The Xbox that was a great find, and uh, well, there's a Michael Kors in the other. You know, I think we found the second Michael Kors. That's it, right? Two Michael Kors. I don't know. I I've been here for a few hours now and uh van is almost full i mean like really almost full i still got to get all this stuff gone but it's not going in the van today but uh all the good stuff right that bin all the all that's good stuff those are dienza the two um all the postal service ones will bring home and that and then this right here we'll bring that home and i'll show Jana. pull out anything the good these are all empty games here it's nothing um yeah, and then just like, ugh. Gotta get this all fit in the van, and then I'll come back tomorrow and get the rest of it after I empty the van. Fill, empty, repeat. Fill, empty, repeat. That's what we do. Fill up our car, either the van or the trailer or the truck or all of the above, and then empty it, and then go back for more. I do love this job. This is fun. 710, what I say? A little over 800, all in with fees and the storage for a month. I have like another week for that uh, rental. Two, one or two weeks. I think about 10 days, so it's not a rush, but I'm just happy to get through it. But you know what? I'll tell you what, guys. I took a chance on this one. I think we'll make our money back. There's plenty of good stuff, but we're not going to make a huge profit on this one it wasn't uh it wasn't one of those good luck to you god bless you and we'll see you next time here on vlogging